Stanley's lineup of laser distance measurers touts a variety of functions and applications. For difficult height measurements, the TLM-165 and TLM-330 allow you the ability to use the Pythagoras function to calculate a height measurement indirectly. The LDM's Pythagoras function uses the same math we learned in high school, a squared plus b squared equals c squared. This video will show you what to measure in order for the LDM to calculate your missing height. Furthermore, there are three different Pythagoras modes for you to use depending on your situation. Pythagoras 1, Pythagoras 2, and Pythagoras partial height. This video will also explain when to use each one. Pythagoras 1 is used when measuring a building. The user can step away, point the LDM to the bottom of the building, and then at the top. Essentially, you are making a triangle between yourself and the building, and measuring two sides, leaving the LDM to calculate the third. The height of the building is automatically calculated for you. To find Pythagoras 1 with a TLM-165, push the function button until you see a triangle indicating you are in Pythagoras 1 mode. For the TLM-330, push the button displaying the triangle with a line across the middle. The blinking sides of the triangle tell you which side to measure. Pythagoras 2 is found by pushing the same function button twice. This allows you to measure three points. For example, if you needed to measure the building from on top of a hill, you could measure to the top of the building, straight ahead at 90 degrees, and the bottom point of the building, which would be lower than you at this point. This again calculates the height of the distance between the highest and lowest targets. Pythagoras partial height is only capable on the TLM-330 by pushing the function button a third time. This allows you to measure the partial height of something you may not be able to reach, such as the height of a window on a tall building. Measure the three points indicated with a flashing light, and your distance will be calculated. 